how surprised you are by today's events, but you certainly <laughs> shocked the rest of the bass fishing world with a monster sack of fish. Came from, oh, what, six pounds down mm -hmm. to win the Bassmaster Classic on the final day. What's going through your mind right I now? I just, somebody pinched me. Is this really happening? You know, I, to catch 29 pounds is just almost unheard of, you know, the final day like that. So it's just a huge blessing. Um, no other way to say it, but uh, just thankful, thankful. I can't believe I won a Classic. I mean, did you foresee this at all? Oh, no. You know, that area, I knew there was big ones in there, but I didn't know I could catch that many of them. You know, I, my goal was to go in there and get two or three big ones. Like, I thought I could catch two or three of those five, six-pounders, you know. I ended up catching a stringer of them. And it's real clear water, shallow water. Was wind the key that made the difference? No today? difference. I had to have it. I didn't go in there first two days. You don't have wind. Well, buddy, way to adjust to the conditions. Congratulations. You. Appreciate you. Well, what goes up must come down, and uh, i tell you what, what came down was a couple of records today. Edwin Evers with the biggest swing, uh, down six pounds, ended up up ten pounds. That's the greatest swing ever by a classic champion, and he also, by one ounce, beat Randy Howell's record for the heaviest single, um, single last day weight for a classic champion. It was a miraculous feat, uh, brought the crowd to their feet, and uh, he really just shot everybody Evers did today with his big win uh, over his good buddy. Jason Christie and the rest of the field here at the 2016 Bassmaster Classic.